about how to do our quarter rounds from our ceiling trim down to the floor trim. We're working specifically in the corner. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our quarter inch round trim and we're gonna butt it up to our ceiling trim. We're gonna do a 45 degree angle on the inside of this trim because we want to have our paint and our finish to the outside. I'll show you more about this cut at the saw. So for measuring our trim, I'm going to measure about halfway up on the current trim that's between the ceiling and the wall. So I'm going to measure at about 92 and a half. We can do this because our trim will cover part of that trim when it's all together. So now we're going to cut our quarter round trim. We're going to move the saw to the 45 degree angle this way. Since this is the top of our trim, we want the 45 degree angle to have the trim side be the long side. So we're going to put the very inside of this trim up against the fence. And then now we're going to cut it. So that is the angle of the trim that we want with the long side being the trim side. So when measuring, we want to make sure to measure from the top part of the trim because that is the length of the trim that will be showing and be covering our top trim. This is how our uh, trim lines up with our top quarter round trim. Uh, we realize that some people might do it differently, but since our trim has the paper on the outside, this is how we like to do it, and this is what works best for us. Give the video a like and a thumbs up, and uh, just remember that uh, if we can do it, so can you. <laughs>